We're here in the Ozarks, and it's the time of year where I want to talk with you about a very important plant. This is a hybrid persimmon. This is a cross between the wild persimmon that grows all over and the giant Japanese type persimmons that we eat at Thanksgiving. It's sweet as candy. Ah, uh, the hybrids to me are are the best of both worlds. Bigger size, fewer seeds, less astringency, um, gorgeous um, color. We're gonna graft that to an American uh, uh, rootstock, which is well suited for the, where we live. These hybrids will stay on the tree longer. Uh, you can actually wait till they get ripe to pick them off so you don't have them on the ground very much. So I think the a I think the right Asia-American hybrid is perfect for our part of the world. It's like strawberry jelly growing on a tree, a candy sweet autumn treat, just in time for Thanksgiving. Isn't it wonderful when healthy tastes so good? Uh, and uh, this taste is fantastic. Uh, it's like honey with very special, fresh, sweet, and a little flower and smell. The cool thing about hybrid persimmons in the Ozarks is that you never have to spray them. They are incredibly disease resistant. You get the advantage of the rootstock being indigenous to uh, this country and do, do very, very well in, in poor soils and tough situations like we have in Missouri. Not just survive here, but, but do really well here and be very efficient at, at grabbing the nutrients that are available uh, and sending up to the fruit production. So I find persimmons probably the easiest to grow in the Ozarks. And since most of them are hardy to negative 15 degrees Fahrenheit, they make the perfect permaculture plant. 